Hello, this is Kristen at Servantech, and in this tutorial we're going to take a look at setting up a category blog layout in Joomla 2.5. Um, one reason you might use a category blog layout is to show intro text from several different articles on one page. So for instance, on this particular site I've pulled up, we have under our news menu item, we have a newsletter archive section. Now if I were to click on this, we currently only have one newsletter here. So what we want to do is add another newsletter and only show the intro text of this article. So the way that we would do this is we'll go to the back end of our website and under content we're going to go to the article manager. Now we can either just choose to add a new article right here from the menu. Um, it's kind of a quick link to get you started or you can actually go to the article manager where you'll see all of your articles and you can choose the add new button at the top. So I'm going to go ahead and choose that add new button and I'm going to call this newsletter 2. And I need to be sure that I set the category to newsletters because this is how the main menu knows um, where to put this article. And what I need to do now is just input some text, which I have saved some. I'm just going to copy and paste this from a text editor. Um, just remember when you're cutting and pasting text into um, the Joomla website, you'll want to use text from a text editor um, rather than a Word document. It just allows you to bring in plain text um, and not pull in any unnecessary formatting that you sometimes have in a Word document. So, um, what we need to do now is add a read more link. If we go back to the Seasons Newsletter archive page, you'll see um, this first article has a read more link. And if we click it, we can see the full article. So we want to add another article that would have a read more link. So in order to do that, we need to choose a place where we want the break to be. So I'll put it after this first paragraph. And then I will use the read more icon, which if you're having trouble finding the read more icon in the text editor that you're using, um, you can just hover over the icons until you um, read the insert read more. Um, all, each of the text editors are a little bit different. This, this one is the JCE text editor. So I'm going to click this icon and I will save and close my article. Now let's take a look at that current season's, um, the newsletter archives page again. I'll just refresh it. And I think we were on the current page. So this is that actual page, the season's newsletter archives page. And you'll see now we have newsletter two at the top and um, the God has a plan article falls below that. Now um, the way that we set the order uh, as well as tell it how many articles to display and how to display them would be in the menu, uh, main menu. So we're going to go back to the back end and let's choose the menus, main menu. Now once here, we can scroll down to find the Seasons Newsletter Archives menu item. And here you'll see that we have set the menu item type to be a category blog menu type, which if we click the select button, we could always change this, but this is where we came originally to set it to a category blog layout. It's listed under articles. So we'll click that again, and you'll see that the category we have chosen is newsletters. Um, these are categories that we've already set up uh, in our category manager, which you can look at another tutorial for that. Um, for more information there, but we've got it set to the newsletters and in the blog layout options you'll see that um, we have the number of leading articles set to zero, um, we have the intro article set to four, this just means that uh, four articles could potentially appear on that page before they start to become paginated, which um, there is an option a little bit further down, pagination and pagination results, where 
Um, you can choose to hide these or show these or use the global settings. Our global settings are currently set to display these. So once we have, say, five articles in our newsletter category, um, you'll see the first four appear on that page with the intro text. And then you'll see some buttons along the bottom that will tell you, that will allow you to flip to see more of these. And you can also um, set these up to display in columns if you wanted them to display in columns. We currently have all of the articles displaying in one column in the article display, um, and we don't have any links appearing. So this is, the, this is where we set our settings. Um, we also can adjust the order, as I mentioned before. The article order here is showing most recent first. So as the new newsletters come out, they will rise to the top. So that's all for this tutorial. Um, I encourage you to check back for new tutorials on Joomla 2.5.